Welcome to Retired Backyard Birders. Today we are checking out the parking lot for the Monticello Ecological Park. As you can see, there are a lot of loose gravel, big stones. So we will slowly make our way down the path. But there are large boulders in the path. Today is November 13th, 2020. If we're careful, we can make our way down this path. But you can see the loose gravel. You can see the big boulders. Be careful. A lot of obstacles. I'll take my time. A lot of obstacles. A lot of big stones right in front of you. You go slow as well. We don't need you falling. Come to your left a little bit. Okay. It's a little bit smoother in the middle. All right. What a beautiful day. Yes, it is. We want to see where this trail leads us from the parking lot. But you can see there are very many large stones and loose gravel. Well, it'd be a bumpy ride if you were in a wheelchair. That is for sure. <laughs> I guess that'd be the fun of it though. It'd if be like going on a roller coaster perhaps. If you're a nature junkie and you love nature. Big stone right in front of you, be careful. Step over. It's all about the fun and the adventure. As long as you're careful. You're coming up to some more big stones in the path. Carefully walk ahead of it. Now it seems to be smooth for a few feet. Okay, we'll, we'll manage. We'll manage. As long as we're careful, we shouldn't have any problems. Stay to your left, a, right a little bit. There are stones right in front of you. Yeah, I, I can feel that. Now come back to the center a little bit. There are logs and pieces of wood in front of you. More stones. Yeah, well, we've never been this way before. <laughs> A new adventure. Awesome, I love it. Ah, oh, smell those pine trees. There's quite a few of them. I'll well, plan around and let you see before we continue on the trail. We're coming up to a bend in the trail. When we get to it, listen to the sound of my voice, and we will make a right turn. You stay close to beside me. There are stones to our right that you can trip over. Slowly move ahead. We are turning to the right. Looks like if we stay in the middle, We'll be all right. Okay, let's continue. I'll stay right behind you. Let's take your time. This seems to be a sand path with a few little limbs and leaves across it with some roots sticking up. And it appears it leads into the area where they have put up the new pavilion for the picnic tables, which is not wheelchair accessible. It seems the dirt trail gets a little bit better than the first trail we were on. 
Are there any markers that lead down to the main part of the trail? You no, see anything? there are not. Pan around, see if there's any markers. Just a lot of trees. No markers to tell where you are. What's ahead of us? So nobody blind or with low vision or severely messed up vision could find their way. Okay. All right. I was just curious. Maybe I could get some signage to put up. That would be a good thing. So we're going to go ahead a little bit farther. At least we have the availability to get our signage for almost bottom dirt pricing, which is fantastic. Glad Chris wants to work with us at a dollar a sign. We're going to take a little break here so I can pan around and show you the loose gravel leading up to the picnic area. It's nothing but loose gravel. There's no way a wheelchair could make it up this. Well, if it had knobby tires, if you wanted to pay that kind of money, to have knobby tires put on your wheelchair, you might be able to do this all right. You'd still need help getting to the picnic tables. Which are not wheelchair accessible. No, it's all they're all really close together, aren't they? Yes, they are. Okay. And then with the bathroom, you have a step up, so there's no wheelchair access there. Well, it's okay, you know, this stuff is easy to fix. We're not asking for money. We're so, just we're asking. just asking for a little assistance to get pointed in the right direction to be able to get this stuff done without costing the city any stress or any financial discomfort it can be done yeah, it, it can be done this is a beautiful park and we are going to make it accessible for everybody i'm going to pan to my right and show you where the restrooms are if you will go back to the dirt trail now if you follow my voice right behind you we're going to go Slightly to the left and straight forward. Okay. So we're go gonna make our way to the restroom. Yes, we are. <laughs> okay. There is some right. loose dirt, some sticks in the way, but if we're careful, once again, we will be able to make it. Follow my voice. We will go straight forward. Come to your right just a little bit. Okay. Now follow my voice, and we're going to go forward. We have a limb here in the way. It's a small one, but follow my voice and we'll sidestep it. We're coming up to the side of the restroom. And I will pan and show you that there are no ramps leading up to it. But to step up, if you don't have a sighted guide with you, how are you going to know that? You don't have strong arms and able to work your wheelchair. You're not going to be able to get up here in order to use the bathroom. Now, wait a minute. If I was in a wheelchair and I was okay. wheeling my way up here. Step up. If I don't break my, my neck. This is the door. That's the door to the women. I'll open it up. My wheelchair will no doubt hit this piece here and I'm going to fall and get hurt. So that's always interesting. But the restrooms are wheelchair accessible, they say. They are. They're, they're Step very, down. very big indoors, inside. Fall All I need is a little extra dirt here to get the wheelchair up. And perhaps a ramp at each end. Well, let's move on. And there's a water fountain there. We're going to head back to the trail. Let's head on back to the car and enjoy the rest of our day. Sounds like a plan.
stay to your left a little bit. There's a little bit of obstacles here in front, right in front of me. Forward a little, for a little ways. Then we're going to go to the right when I tell you. Forward. Coming up to loose gravel again. But we'll soon be on the dirt trail. You gotta take that left sooner or later. Don't take forward, know. follow me, follow right, my voice. I'm right behind you. This is the dirt trail, which isn't too awfully bad. That wasn't too bad. It was a little scary. But it wasn't too bad. New adventures a, can be a little scary. With a little bit of cleanup, some signage, yeah, oh, this will be perfect. People will be able to blaze this trail. We're coming into a little bit of a turn to the left. Not much of one, so we just slowly continue forward. And we'll be all right. A little bit of an uphill climb going back. I'll tell you, I'd like to lead a, a tour through the whole thing with some sighted people. Okay, we're coming and up to a curve. We have the equipment and the time and the blindfolds to be able to let them know what it's like and walkers to let them know what it's like to be handicapped a little bit and disabled to be able to make it way through these travels. Okay, we're going to the left, and we're going to go straight forward. There are boulders and bricks to your okay, left. we got it. And we'll slowly make our way back to the car. All right. Hey. It's a beautiful day. Yes, it is. I see butterflies, dragonflies. As long as you stay in the center, you'll do pretty good. Not too much boulders or debris in the middle of it. There's a big boulder in front of you. Go to your left a little bit. Okay. Now forward. Coming up to some more rocks sticking up out of the ground. Walk very carefully. Now come back to the center where we missed most of that. Really need a rubber ball on the end of my chain here. <laughs> Go to your left a little bit, there are rocks in front of you. Straight forward. Now it shouldn't be too bad to have a car from here. As we slowly make our way up there. Well, we want to thank you for watching our short video. We hope you enjoyed our little adventure. And uh, we hope to see you again. This is Retired Backyard Birders. So long. Have a good day. Stay safe.